Hello everybody, and welcome back to Mafia 3. As I said in the last video, I took care of all those dead drop locations, and I guess we're ready to take out the guy. Let's talk to Harold. Yeah, yeah, uh, that's fine. That's You've, fine. Uh, really got poor Frankie in a bit of hot water over at the bathhouse. Sorry, shitty pun. <laughs> because of you, Tony D'Arazio is having a hard time controlling the city's politicos, so he's ordered Frankie to keep an eye on the Imperial. It's, uh third strike you're dead situation how do you think you'll handle old frankie that's all up to him hey i could tag along my camera's in the car no you want to dig up more dirt for your rag you do it on your own time i ain't gonna drag your libelous ass all over town i get it i get it be seeing you if you kill bernard be sure to let me know what happened okay oh sure i, I doubt we'll ever see each other again though <laughs> all right so confront frankie bernard wherever the hell he is Alright, so we'll get over there. Probably the same thing. He's surrounded by goons. We get in there, confront him, recruit him. The whole nine yards, right? So from now on, I'm going to try and trim the fat wherever I can regarding this series, because it's like I've been saying throughout, a lot of the things you do are repetitive. You're basically just clearing out sector after sector to do the same sort of activity. It's just in a new area. <clears throat> so if there's any opportunities for me to trim the fat, like I said, I will try to take advantage of them. But for now, let's focus on our objective. We have to get this guy. Easy does it. Alright, so wherever the hell... We're going to find Frankie is where we have to go. It's not going to be the bathhouse again, is it? That'd be kind of awkward. Oh, it's that building right there. Is that the bathhouse? I can't tell. It kind of looks like the bathhouse again. Oh, there's a lot of people in there. Holy shit. Yeah, it is the bathhouse again. All right. Ah, oh, shit balls. This is not going to be easy. I already spot two sentries in the lobby. This is going to suck. Fucking hell. How am I gonna do this? I doubt there's a way for me to get upstairs through here, but. No, not really. So, why would there be a shotgun in the locker room? It's kind of like dangerous, don't you think? I do not have a lot of ammo, I just realized shit. Oh, I got some ammo for some strange reason, okay. I don't know if I could shoot through this window. No, I can't. Must be reinforced or something. All right. Oh, balls. Yeah, this is going to be a pain in the ass to do. But either way, I can't just stand around doing nothing, right? Okay, time to die. You guys don't care? They just killed your... to the kill that guy? Alright. Oh, now we start up the horn's nest. Get this useless fucking body out of here! Oh shit! As long as the sentry doesn't see me, he won't call for reinforcements, right? That's how it works. He's fucking dead. You're next. Yeah, he caught around the corner like an idiot. Okay, so another one to the right. Have to be wary, wary of him. What? Look how many fucking guards this asshole has. Oh, shit. He did. I wonder if he's over there. 
there. Okay, I have to get that sentry first, but I have no shot. Oh, guys, and there one on the second floor. Shit. That sentry just could. Co uh, shit. What the hell is that guy doing? Did he fall in the water? Okay, so apparently the guys can't swim. The guards or whatever? Okay. Okay, I think that sentry on this, this floor move. I'm gonna try and get him first. Yeah, he certainly did. Uh, now Frankie knows I'm here. Shit. So I imagine the only way you get to the second floor is through the stairway I used last time, right? I don't see any other stairs to get up there, so we're going to have to go straight through the bathhouse. Okay, I missed my first shot, got the second one, though. I'm just afraid they can move over the balcony and shoot me. They could probably do that. Yeah, they definitely can. Oh, shit, I don't know how I should, how I should approach this. This asshole would stick his head out, I could get a shot, yeah, but he's not... I don't think that's a good shot. I'm not gonna take it. Shit, too early. Fuck. Okay, that was... I did too early again. Heal. I have to stop fucking doing that. Only do it when the prompt appears. He got me down to one health bar again? Are you fucking serious? That was a pistol. It wasn't a... Fuck. Are you dead yet? How are you not dead yet? Come on. It's not popping up again. I can't fuck, move. Come on. I'm boxed in. Help me out here. Down. Stupid asshole is not popping up again. Uh, at least the bullets, nothing I can do about it. Okay. Okay. Well, might as well grab in there and needle while we're here. Follow me. Oh, fuck. Fuck. I'm taking way too much damage here. Way too much damage. Bad time to poke your head out. I still don't have the Thompson ammo. That's very unfortunate. Okay, so this guy to the left, the guy's to the right. I got this some bitch. No, I don't think you do. It just really sucks that if you die, you gotta do the whole thing over again. You just get no checkpoints. Very annoying. There's only a few sentries left. It looks like there's one on the third floor. Fuck. 
maybe I don't have to deal with the sentry on the third floor if I'm lucky. This guy just refuses to die. As long as that sentry doesn't, as long as that sentry doesn't see me, I think I'm okay. Oh, now he's down finally. Oh, shit. I just hope the sentry can come down here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can he come down here? I'm not sure. Yes, he can. Shit. I just keep an eye on him. I don't want to call him for backup. Uh, we got more guards. We got more guards. Two more, and then the guy. Running for cover. Oh, he's behind the wall. I don't have a shot at him yet. Oh, you're not calling for backup. Fuck you. Fuck you. Oh, he's in the next room. Okay. I seize you. Hmm. How am I going to approach this? That was simple enough. Frankie, you're next. Ooh, this is not a good position to ambush him from, though. Was shit. Can I go around, maybe? Why can't they find it? Where'd he go? I don't think there's another entrance there. Shit, that might be a problem. If I could go around, I guess not. God damn it. He's just gonna stay in there, isn't he? Shit. Why can't they find this fuck? Try a grenade? That's not what I want to do! Okay, that's not what I want to do. I want to cancel the grenade. Shit. I'm thinking it's time you expand your clientele, Frankie. Think you can handle that? Sure. Tony D's not gonna like this, though. Let me worry about the Razio. All right. Blackmail racket secured. Oh shit, who should I who should I assign to? I don't know who to assign this to. Yeah, I kinda of feel bad for this guy, so I'm gonna send it side to him. Some help securing it. Well, send me lodge out there, but you gotta know I ain't happy about how the last set down went. Hard to not take that kind of fucking personal. Burke, I had to make a choice. I'm sorry. I know what you're talking about, that stupid meeting we had. They threw me right on the spot. I had to give it to somebody. Fuck. 
I mean, I don't know what else I could have done in that scenario. Cassandra didn't seem so bothered about it, but Burke took it personally. For whatever reason. I just don't see why we all just can't get along. We're all criminals, right? Kill Tony, Tony DeRozio. Cool, now where is... Talk to Donovan about Tony DeRozio. Alright. Explosive supply, alright. Alright, so I think we have enough time for another mission if we hurry. Let's try to kill Tony DeRozio. Shall we? Yes. Yes, we shall. Oh, he's down here, Donovan. We're place for a meeting, don't you think, Donovan? If you're ready to lay hands. How did you manage to get to Tony DeRazio? I had bugs and wiretaps all over the damn place. When that weirdo left the Royal Hotel to deal with one of his men, I was listening. What the hell is going on here? I didn't know you was coming. I'm just packing away your latest shipment. You're gonna be dead in a few seconds. How long you been running this business, Joe? <laughs> I, I, I know five, six years. Five years, three months, and eighteen days. This is two. Look, I, I know I've been lied, but it ain't my fault. I've always placed a premium on maintaining order. If you let the rot set in. Eventually, it will take hold and destroy everything you've built. The only solution is to isolate, eradicate it before it takes hold. You understand, Joe? Christ, Donnie, you gotta listen to me. Some nuts out there shooting hell out of everything. You know how many of my men he killed? Yes. Ugh. Okay. Dominic, is it? I'd be swaying bullets if I was his. If I was this guy. You will take the armored car and personally oversee the collection of all outstanding monies owed to us. Am I clear on this? Y yes, Mr. Razio. Once you have collected what is due, deliver it directly to me at the hotel. The code to the elevator is 0451. <laughs> Isn't that like always a code for everything in video games? 0451? Very cliche. From there, Lincoln had a couple of options. He could use the elevator code and go into the lobby, which meant shooting the hell out of the place. Or, or he could steal Dominic's car and go in quiet through the hotel's parking garage. Do I have to choose? Grab a couple of those little fancy soaps. <laughs> they won't give me any more at the motel. Oh, so do I have to choose or not? I know you can't see it, but it says kill Tony DeRazio, steal Dominic's car. I mean, I'm not indifferent to either method, but I don't know what's easier. Okay, let's get there first and worry our battle plan. So he's at a hotel or something, but... Oh god, I received the bread marks from here. Okay, so I do have to steal his car, that much is apparent. A lot of goons guarding it, though. I don't think I should pull a gun out on the street like this. Okay, 
Okay, get the alley for our civilian Caesars. That was pretty smooth, not gonna lie. Pretty smooth. Okay, so I got the car. Drive to the whole Royal Hotel's garage. Alright. I mean, I don't know, maybe I could just went through the lobby, but I think it's not what the game told me to do at this point. Is that the hotel? God damn, that's tall. I mean, it's a hotel, so we expect, of course, it to be tall, but still. Hmm, this is eerily reminiscent from the first Mafia game, where we had to go into the hotel. Okay, so... Probably they didn't look at me. I guess they just saw the car on the foot, that was okay. Tch. Oh, balls. Balls, balls, balls. So the elevator is right over there, but there's plenty of guys in my way. This gun reloaded. Yes, it is. Okay, just making sure. Time to die. Here, over here. Got him. Over here. Heading for cover. That's my girl. Mm. Fuck. Get him. You guys gotta want to keep your heads down. You really do. Oh, I got plenty left for you. Oh, he's out there, huh? Alright. Is anyone else with him, or is it just one guy? It's just one guy, okay. You have to admit, I'm getting better with these headshots. <laughs> I guess it's from all the time I've been playing this damn game. Alright, so there's the elevator. Let's take me directly to this Durazio guy. Very spacious elevator, I must say. Taken the appropriate steps to address the situation. Believe me, things are well in hand. Well, they fucking better be. If this <laughs> thing with the judge goes sideways, shit's gonna roll downhill real fucking quick. We haven't lost anything of any significance except for some men, and they can be replaced. In fact, they are the easiest thing to replace. Saul doesn't give two shits about any of those stupid fucks. All he cares about is the people that matter. Understand? I understand completely. And you have my word that all payments will continue as scheduled. None of our business associates need to concern themselves with our recent difficulties. Yeah? Okay. I'm counting on you here, Tony. Don't fuck this up. Goodbye. Okay, Baldy, your time is cut. Okay. Real graphical glitch there. How many men are we looking at here? I honestly can't tell because I can't see any men. Alright, fine. He has to have bodyguards, right? He just has to. Saw that coming. Fucking hell, that's a lot of people. Take the rest of the day off. There is a vest somewhere on the next floor, but I have no access to it yet. Right. This is going to suck ass. Big mistake, asshole. Run, rabbit, run. Heading for cover. Our flight's going down. Who you think you're fucking with? 
I should be asking you that. Okay, that was a little sloppy, but whatever. I didn't take any damage. That's the most important thing. Where you going, asshole? Okay, so we have to keep going up, I'm assuming. Shit. Will you fucking hold still? Almost had him. No, I'm st my heart's still racing because you could die so easily in this game. It's unbelievable. It really is. And don't forget, I'm playing on normal difficulty since the start. Fuck you. Don't pop out of cover if you're not reloaded, jackass. Hmm. I'm sure no one surprises me. Ow! Get my health up, please. Thank you. Heal. That's a lot of people he has. Should I expect it this much? Probably. Need out. We got one at least. More either in us. Got that right. Tch, idiot. Okay, we're doing okay so far. Not great, but okay. I'd like to get that medicine if I can. This will work. And of course there's more men. Why wouldn't there be? You just have to move, didn't you? I could have said the same thing to you. I'm supposed to go through here. And hey, we're not even there yet. We have a whole narrow level to cross. Oh shit. Oh shit. This sucks. Got that right. Way too long. No shot from there. I'm gonna have to move up. One more. Okay, I don't know if he can open that door or not. Is there one to my right? Nobody to my right, that's good. Oh, it's on the balcony. Oh fuck, there is people to my right. Shit. Shit. Okay, I didn't see these people. How many more men are we looking at? Jesus Christ. I mean, if they have 
access to that stairway on the left, I did not feel comfortable moving any closer at this point. Shit, what am I gonna do? I don't wanna rush into things, when I rush into things I die. I would like to get that vest. I don't know how to get to it though, shit. Do I even want to know what's on the television? Probably not. Slip behind it. Shit. They're not coming down. I'm gonna have to go after them. Getting out of here. Where's that vest? Give me that vest. Thank you. Oh shit, right outside the door. Okay, looks like two more. Okay, do they have a shot for me? No, I don't think they do. Damn, I took a hit. Covering my ass. Hmm. Where you going, asshole? Oh. Hmm, is that how we could muster the Razio? Is that all the muscle you could throw at me? He doesn't seem like very disturbed about what's going on though. It's like he was expecting this or something. Mm. Whatever, we gotta go confront this fucker. I mean, how's this gonna go down? Got that right. Whoa, fucking hell! RPG, isn't that a little too much? So you really think you know how all this is gonna play out, don't you? Idiot! Go ahead. Kill me. I'll be replaced tomorrow. No one will even notice. You're from out the window? Wrong. Everyone will notice. <laughs> yep, he's gonna from out the window. I called that. streets of our fair city as a gunman stormed the Royal Hotel, killing an untold number of men. There was a loud crash, like a bomb going off. I looked up and there was a man falling from the top of the building. Then all these men showed up and every one of them had a gun. They ran into the Royal and that's when the shooting started. <laughs> I still don't know how the hell Lincoln got out of that hotel. That's a very good point. From the guy out the window is gonna create a lot of attention. Oh, we're not done yet. We are not d oh fuck. Oh fuck fuck fuck. We're not done yet. How the hell did more guys get up here so quickly? I already thought we'd be done after this, I guess not. Bandos, 
There's a guy in the balcony, isn't there? Yes, there is. Shit. I know there's a door there. How are we gonna get out of here, by the way? I thought there'd just be like a cutscene transition or something. I guess not. Alright. So we have to go... Oh, just into the elevator, that's it. It's that simple? It cannot be that simple. Oh, fucking hell. This sucks. Look how many fucking guys are down there. Holy shit. You don't see shit. Mm. I don't know how we're going to do this. We're looking at a shit ton of guys here. The problem is I'm afraid they could just climb up here or take the stairs or whatever. Oh boy. Nice and slow. No need to rush through this. Oh, there's a guy on this floor. Shit. There's another guy to the right. I mean, I'm in the pretty defensible position here. But if I leave, that's gonna be a problem. How do I get rid of the cops again? I don't think I can do it because I'm in the mission. Shit. Oh, come on, go after the criminals, you fucking idiots! Do you not see the other guys with guns, you fucking morons? Why do they always prioritize me and never them? So stupid. Gonna put you down, son. Well, I can't stay here forever now, can I? Ow. You son of a bitch! Me, waste my damn vest on you. I'm pinned down. Ring out pistol bullets too. I'm down. I switch guns. Those fucking cops. These fucking pigs. Well, next time choose a safer profession, dingus. Okay, this really sucks. All these guys are coming after me. Why did that guy go down? Fuck! Who 
this is really bad. I don't know what I'm gonna do here. I'm empty. See, they're fighting alongside the gangsters. How the fuck does that work? How does that even work, guys? Heal. God damn it. Well, you kill me if I fucking fucking kill you. It was like a whole bunch of them were below me, but where am I supposed to go after this? Through the front door? It's so stupid how they just ignore everybody else. They just come after me. Fuck! Get out of here! Oh, would they go away if I stay quiet for a bit? Shit. Damn it. I'm gonna have to get a car get the fuck out of here. Is that it? Or should I go with the garage? I don't know what to do here. Shit. Oh, now they're on to me. This stinks. How many fucking cops are after me now? Good God. Oh, this bitch took a lot more than I thought of it, guys. I'm sorry. Oh God, now they have SWAT vans? Shit. This fucking sucks. Yep, got he's all over the damn place. How am I supposed to deal with this? Out of the way! Shit. Wait, now it has to be a full 360 degree circle. God damn it. Shut up. Oh shit, I think they busted my tires. Not cool. God damn you sons of bitches. Now my pistol bullets. I'm 
I'm not gonna make it. I am not gonna make it. Yeah, this really sucks. Okay, I take it back. <laughs> God damn, that was close. I was a lot of health, too. Please just end the fucking mission. I can't take anymore. Are we back at the meeting place? Ah, oh, shit. Do I have to sign their district to somebody? Pull up a seat. Let's get cracking. Tony DeRazio just kissed the pavement outside the Royal Hotel. Downtown is ours. Cabal construction in the sham work sites, the Imperial, and all the limp dicks who owe the mob money, we own it all. Things are humming along in a holler. Of course, it's the only Oh, come on, don't let me do this again. I say it's time to throw these rackets here my way. I'm fine with occasionally splitting things when we gotta lock the auction down. But continuing to ask my boys to do work that's gonna put money in someone else's pocket. That's when we tread into areas they don't care for. The Irish deserve to hold on to this piece of the city. We're on a good run here, Lincoln. I see no reason anything should change. Now, not using my guys to lock down a district makes it real fucking messy if you want us to run shit, but... Hell, you pay me to clean up the mess. Don't make me fucking do this. Anytime you want to make a call, I'm good with that. A man earns respect by making hard choices. All right, I feel bad for Burke. We're gonna give it to Burke. This one's all you, Burke. Oh, fucking hell! You're smarter than your goddamn luck, lad. My men do what I tell them to do. Their loyalty is unmatched. I'm sorry, Cassandra. I really am. That hurts me. Which in turn hurts you. I'm gonna call this if no one else will. We'll talk later. Get on out of here. God damn, I hate doing this. Why is the game making me do this? Alright, next one I have to give to Cassandra. Fuck. I feel so bad. I really do. I get raw criminals, we all kill people, but still, you gotta have honor among thie uh, thievery. They're saying you threw Tony off the roof of the Royal? Actually, it was through his penthouse. Yeah, it wasn't the roof. <laughs> you always had a flair for the dramatic. Tony's legend. Last couple pages are pretty interesting. Any idea what US 5CJ means? Wait a minute. Holy shit. Why is Lou willing to comp 10 grand a month at a brothel in the same at a drug den? Based on what Greco told me in Scaletta, Marcano's laying out a bunch of money to get gambling legalized. And if that's what you're after, who better to have in your pocket than a judge on the Fifth Circuit Court of Appeals, US 5CJ? Oh. Exactly. There have to be over 20 judges on that bench. Could be any one of them. The kind of man we're talking about isn't used to people getting into his business. I start visiting the places listed in that legend, they panic, and go to Lou for help. And that's when we'll find out who he is. With that wiretap running. Never turn it off. <laughs> Alright, I really think I was going to get away from them. Queer blues police and cops in their crimes for two minutes. See, that's the thing about these markers. I only have a certain amount of them, so if I waste them on something I don't need, that's going to be a problem. Am I always supposed to use the markers in an emergency situation? I don't know. Armored Majesty, the way to your delivery service, okay. Increased ammo, quick ammo, yeah, that'd be very useful for all firearms, hell yes. Now you've got the Tony Rose Pen to get the asshole he kicked up to for Cross Brother Capital. Uncle Wu Marcano, alright. Uh 
Okay, let's talk to Harold Colby again. So this is the big thing we're about to do now. Taking out one of the major players like I did with Corset. Problem is I don't have a car. Let me just look over the map real quick. What else did I want to do? There's something else I wanted to do, wasn't there? Oh yeah, I want to see the Father James. Can we do this real quick? How am I going to get a car? Okay, is there like a parking lot I could take a vehicle from, please? How you doing? Parking lot, please? Running on a strict timer here. Fine, fuck it. I'm not sure what this Father Jay's mission entails, but I think it's just like it could be like a quick cutscene. Considering we're running, running on a tight schedule, I might as well just get this done right now, right? We have it's just, it's still like nine minutes, guys. Again, apologies for... I don't know, should I just cut it here? I don't think I should just cut it here. Because we're at 52 minutes already. It doesn't pay... Yeah, I can't cut anything out of this. I'll try to get there as quick as I can. I promise you that. I don't want to have you guys sit for a 50 minute video. This is too long. You know? That's why I like to keep my videos around 30 minutes. It's not too long for anyone to, di to, to, uh, to digest, you know? 30 minutes seems appropriate for a Let's Play. A single Let's Play video, in my opinion. Alright, where the hell is Fire James? It just really sucks that I have to make the decision regarding these rackets, who to assign them to. I mean, if there was an option to split things evenly amongst the three people, I would do it, but the game is not giving me any such option. Which is very unfortunate. I mean, again, all three of them want more businesses so they can make more money, but... I have to make a call at some point. Alright, this is Far James' house. Yep, that's his house. Hopefully this is not a mission. This is not a mission, it's just a cutscene. Let's see. I have to tell you why I became a priest. Because of what you saw during the war. That... That was a lie. I became a priest because of what I did during the war. What it turned me into when I was over there, crammed together with all the other disposable Negroes. All the hurt, all the rage I'd accumulated over my life came boiling up, and once it was out, well, you don't want to know. I doubt anyone's losing sleep over some dead Nazis. That's not the point. The men I killed, killing them should have meant something to me. Should have had weight, but it didn't. And glimpsing what was buried down inside me, it, it, it was too much. I know who I am. I know you do, son. And that's what terrifies me. Well, I was right about being a quick cutscene. Good Lord only burdens us with what we can carry. Where is... Oh, there it is. Well, at least you got that out of the way, right? You got something done. Uh, where's the exit? Okay, now before we wrap up, I just want to go over what else we have available. 
Okay, that's the big thing we have to do in covering the downtown sector, right? Men do. I think this one is the DLC. I'm not sure. I know one of these things for the DLC takes place in the French ward. Oh, so it has something to do with Burke over there. Or is this the DLC? It's one of these things. Is, is the DLC? I think it's called Stones Unturned. Yeah. Yeah, we still got a few a few more areas to take over. I think we've done pretty much everything south. What's that? Oh, that's just the marijuana thing, right? Okay. So, yeah, we're going to have a lot more work to do before this game is over. At least one, two, three, four, five, six areas. Hope you guys enjoy the long Let's Plays. Anyway, that's where I'm going to leave it. I'm going to have to chop this up into two parts because it went on too long. And that's pretty much all I gotta say on the matter. <laughs> Thank you for watching. I will see you in the next video. Bye for now.